when they launch this fake alien invasion, everybody gonna swear it's real. They gonna make this shit look real, y'all. Listen, this is gonna be the biggest movie. Listen, this is gonna be the biggest movie they never put out, nigga. Look, look, you see the guys over there. Now look, they over there doing the same thing I'm doing. I'm listening to them talk. Pay attention. We over there rising. You see them? You see them over there? You see God and them over there? And they over there talking that shit. They over there, look, so I was just before I went, listen, they, they saying the same thing we saying. This is what I'm saying, the rise, like, y'all gonna see people taking the street. All this is gonna be taking, taking place. But back to what I was telling y'all, on a more deeper level, real quick, dude, I'm gonna come back at like six with y'all, we're gonna do the subscription giveaway, and we're gonna do a, um, we're gonna do a um, Q&A too. We're gonna do a live Q&A, all that kick and turn up the right way. But what y'all gotta understand, though, is that right now, we in this, we in this time, we in this phase right now, reflection, where they are about to, they are going through everything they can do, all right? Anything they can do to try to keep us um, tuned out of frequency, all right? To keep us to keep us vibrating low, to keep us unaware of who we are. Anything they can do, that's what they're doing. So a lot of a lot of these, like like how they did the back-to-back -back killings, those killings was real, but they're doing all that to harness energy and, to dis and distract you, all right? And right now, they're, they're, they're very scared because we are, we are waking up on a whole different level right now, y'all. We waking up on a whole different level, right? So it's to the point where it's like I say, look, you see the gods over there. They over there. You hear me? They over there kicking shit, right? That wasn't always like that. Feel me? They over there kicking shit. I can go down there. It's motherfuckers kicking shit. I can go right around the corner. I'm in East Atlanta right now. You see what I'm saying? Well, I'm in East Atlanta right now. You know, go right around the corner. You're going to see motherfuckers out here building, kicking, drawing. You know what I'm saying? Our people, you know what I'm saying? People waking up, understanding who the real ops is, who the real enemy is. You feel me? Like it ain't never been us. Alright? So, but if everybody, if everybody, everybody still, like I say, yeah, 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 we know the yeah, we know the enemy, the police, right? But remember who they work for. Remember they just the front line. I also stay, stay also stay focused and prepared for the next phase they finna go into, which is this phase where they finna you hear me? They finna go into this next phase where they finna motherfucking they see us waking up. It's too many. It's too many people waking up. You know what I'm saying? It's too many people that's active. It's too many people that's posting. It's too many of y'all that's sharing. It's just too many people. So what you think their next step is? What you think their next step? I'm, right now, what I'm telling y'all is to keep y'all ahead of the game. Everybody didn't woke up to the point where we kind of seen the police the ops. Okay, that's your step one. Now let's let's move to step two. Understand that they they let that that when they see everybody walk around with locks in their head, everybody walk around braids in their head, everybody going back to their natural self and their natural ways. When they see y'all doing all this posting, when they see people take to the streets, when they see all this going on, guess what that let them know? That let them know, man, that it has begun. The shift has fully begun. So now they have to go to drastic measures to separate everybody. We coming together, y'all. Now, 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 for the first time in a long time, we are coming together, y'all. Right? For the first time in a long time. But be, but, but, but what y'all got to be ready for. We ain't one shit. You know, we coming together. I see the energy rise and I see motherfuckers feeling good too because we people that's been woke seeing other motherfuckers wake up. But hold on, reflection. Hold on, reflection. We ain't did, we ain't won no battles. We ain't did nothing yet. All right? You got to understand that once we do wake up like this and they can't stop social media, no matter if they block me, block somebody, it's just too many people woke. All right? So the next phase is to do something on a drastic level that's going to completely shift, that's going to completely shift and alter the conscious of the community. And the only thing they can do that is this alien invasion. You see the sky behind me? That same, that same sky up there. That motherfucker is not real. Alright? It's not real. I've been telling y'all that for a reason because it's being controlled. It's five layers to it. It's CGI technology. They showed you this shit in that movie Kong when he threw the motherfucking spear at the motherfucking sun, nigga. Right? They showed it right to you. But before they showed it to you in Kong, for those of you who've been listening to me in this university, y'all know from day one, I've been telling y'all this. I've been telling y'all this since last year. And if you know me in real life, I've been telling you this shit 12 years ago. I told you this shit forever. All right? So at the end of the day, understand what's going on right now. Understand understand the shift in consciousness. This is the Kundalini energy rising, man. Come on, man. You know me. I'm not going to never tell y'all nothing wrong, man. This is kundalini energy rising you know what i'm saying it's all about high vibrations right now that's all it's about it, it ain't about it ain't about nothing it ain't about nothing it ain't about nothing else yeah that 
Yeah, yeah that's all the way where the back at the back of shit. But yeah, though, so y'all feel me, though? This is what's going on. So now they about to, remember, I've been telling y'all about the fake alien invasion that they was going to launch. And I haven't said nothing about it because I've been specifically waiting for the right reason. So that's step two, y'all, finna see. Because when they launched the, when they launched this fake alien invasion, everybody gonna swear it's real. You know why? Because people don't know that the sky is CGI technology. I've been telling y'all this. It's not the that's not your real sky. You ain't never seen a real sky day in your life. So people don't know that that's CGI technology up there. So if people don't know that that's CGI technology, all right, once they once they get the change in the frequency of the sky and they get the altering the layers of the sky to make it look like it's a war going on right there, that's not. All right, they make it seem like it's these huge spaceships that's in the sky that's not. And then they're going to actually use actual spaceships that they do have from from other um, extraterrestrial species like these insectoids and these and these greys and these other ones that they got, you know, they got their cahoots with. Are right, they going to make this shit look real, y'all? Listen, this is going to be the biggest movie. Listen, this is going to be the biggest movie they never put out, nigga. This is going to be a, the biggest movie they ever put out. I'm saying movie for a reason because the shit ain't, gonna, ain't real, but it's going to look real. Listen, you, you ain't better tell people that we ain't under a UFO invasion. I'm telling y'all in advance. Listen, man, holographic imagery is real, man. You're going to see motherfucking aliens running down the street, all that. Be prepared for it. I told you here first. I've been telling y'all on Facebook since last year. All right? We at that point now where they finna launch that move. And it's going to really distort the unity amongst us because they, what they're going to do is they launch the move, they're going to they gonna, they gonna, they gonna make it seem like it's bigger than black, white, any of that shit. They're going to be like, listen. We have to unite. First off, they gon' first off they gon' they gon' they gon' kill a lot of people. They gon' make it real. They gon' kill motherfuckers the whole night. All right. Then you know what I'm saying. And they gon' make it seem like we under this threat. They gon' make it seem like we under this huge threat. And it's the threat against all of humanity. So then it's gonna make it. It's gonna make it seem like all the shit that y'all been telling about us uniting. It's gonna all. It's gonna completely kill that for those who sleep. And they gonna put the focus on all that's coming together. Blacks, whites, Latinos, the whole planet to fight against these aliens. To fight against this alien threat that they created. That they are created. That ain't even real. I'm letting y'all know right now. I'm letting you know right now. And when I tell y'all things, those of you who've been here, the whole, the whole thing is this. The whole thing is this. You're living in a movie. Ain't none of this shit real. I told you that. Ain't none of this shit real. Only thing real is you. Your spirit and your soul. Everything else that you see down here in third density is, is alterations of your or figments of people, other people's imaginations. You know what I'm saying? Before they conquered us. Before they conquered us, we just freely created. But after they conquered us, everything you see they control that made, they control this now with the electric light hole lockdown. All right, so everything you see under that is part of that. That's what it's all about. And that's what I want y'all to know. That's what I want y'all to understand. That's what I want y'all to get on the deepest of levels. I can't stand seeing shit like this. Let me show y'all, let me show y'all. Like hole lockdown, you hear me? How the fuck? I never got that. I never got that. Even if your ass ain't woke, how the fuck you gonna just? How you gonna listen? Even if you not third eye not open, you do know this much. You know that we come from straight slavery. You know that they taught you that much in school. So even if you did believe a little bit of the, of the bullshit they taught you in school about slavery, at the least you know they was raping y'all ass. So I always was like, hey, if you're if you're if you're if you're if you're um if you're um if you're if you're if you're, if you're uh, um a, um a, a goddess, how how could you voluntarily just lay down? You know you know your grandma and them was getting raped by him, right? By his ancestors and shit. Like you feel me? And now they 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 fought. To stop getting raped, to stop that, to stop that integration of the genetics, and now here you are freely in 2021, walking down the street proudly, proudly with your little white man, and then go the same thing with the black athletes. The black man do it too, man. You know what I'm saying? I've seen, I see, I feel the same way when they do. Like to me, you can't sell out your race no other way. Man, all these beautiful black guys out here, nigga, better go get you a goddess. Man. I ain't trying to hear nothing. To all my Latino brothers, all my black, you know what I'm saying, y'all? Come on, man. Come on now. Same thing to them guys. That's why I don't fuck with Lapita Nyong'o no more. Like, I love me some Lapita Nyong'o. To her ass. Soon as she got on for 12 years a slave, next thing you know, now, next thing you, next thing you know, now she's out here marrying white men. That's exactly what she did. Period. That's exactly what she did. That's what she did. You feel me? 
So at the end of the day, that's why, that's why I'm telling y'all, like, they be trying to save their genetics. They be trying to save their species. You ain't supposed to integrate. We ain't supposed to integrate. We ain't supposed to, we ain't supposed to mix up our seeds with them. It ain't, that ain't racism or nothing. You know what I'm saying? That's just real life. Really like you're gonna, you're helping them in the war. You know what I'm saying? They trying to create more avatars by mixing their genetics with our genetics. Like, no, let them stay on their side. They do their thing, we do our thing. You know what I'm saying? Y'all ain't even all the way clicked with us yet. Y'all ain't clicked up with all the way with us yet anyway for us to be mixing no seats with y'all. First off, y'all gotta apologize for what the fuck y'all ancestors did. And y'all gotta apologize for being cocky toward us and not accepting these truths that we that we hold to be self-evident. You know what I'm saying? This shit is self-evident. Y'all got all these houses, all this land, all this shit. We don't own none of this shit. I can pan the camera around, nigga. No, nobody black down here own none of this land right here that we standing on right now, nigga. Right now. But guess who shit it was first, nigga? We in East Atlanta, nigga. This is where they, we on Moreland right now, nigga. This is where General Sherman was stomping through here, nigga. Come on, man. I know where I'm at. I know what grounds I'm on. You hear me? Now, they might not know. But I, but I know. I know. You hear me? I know what grounds I'm standing on. So, I don't see nobody, I don't see nobody speaking up on that side for us yet. I ain't seen nobody say we gonna teach them their real history yet. I ain't seen nobody say none of this yet. I just haven't seen it. I just honestly haven't seen it. You hear me? Just like I said with the cops, I ain't seen no police officers yet just come speak out and say, hey, you know what I'm saying? No, nah, um, no, nah, um, you know, those bad cops that we got in our law in law enforcement agency, you know, we, we speak, we not, matter of fact, we, we, we striking against the department because there's too many cops that's killing, that's killing, that's doing, un, um, 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 injustices in the community. I don't see no, no cops saying that. I don't see no cops saying that. Now we can sit here and say all day like, oh, okay, all oh, cops ain't bad. I don't see no motherfucking cops saying something different though. I don't see no motherfucking cops saying nothing different. You see what I'm saying? I ain't trying to hear shit about all oh, cops ain't bad. I don't see no motherfucking cops saying nothing different. Period. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Every time they kill one of us on any form, level, or fashion in life, you know what I'm saying? And then we speak out. Or, or just like I say, I just I put up a post said dead cops coming soon and got blocked. How you blocking me off Facebook 